Delay in payment of insurance claims and poor roads are affecting health care provision at the Center West Hospital at Kwame Danso. An ambulance donated by the MP for the area to complement services has been parked. The Center West Hospital receives referrals from Atebubu Amantin, Center East and community-based health planning and services centers at Kwame Danso and beyond. The 90-bed capacity health facility records close to 400 OPD cases daily but faces some challenges. The National Health Insurance Authority has certified the facility to receive and provide care to patients on the scheme but prompt payments of claim areas by the authority is not done frequently. The last time the facility received payment was in February 2019. Medical superintendent of the hospital, Dr. Anthony Chum, indicated the hospital is highly indebted to suppliers, so it is difficult to assess medical consumables. Project comments have not been completed. 98% of our patients are insured clients, and then because they come in and we offer them the services, delay in payments or reimbursements from insurance is always a challenge. Uh, to, 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 to us. So, therefore, if the insurance does not pay us, it's also difficult for us to be able to get our supplies and medications uh, to be able to attend to this, these clients. Everyday clients do come in and you cannot turn them down. The hospital is in dire need of funds to run the facility. Staff to deliver service to patients is also in short supply as the entire district has only two doctors and one physician assistant attending to cases. They are committed to saving lives, but emergency cases are difficult to handle because most roads in the district are in extremely deplorable state. In 2018, the Member of Parliament for the area donated an ambulance to the hospital, but it is not serving its purpose. Roads here are deadly, resulting in increased travelling time. The situation becomes worse during the rainy season. From here to Atibubu is quite uh, in a deplorable state and it's worse when we are in the rainy season. As we speak now that we are in the dry season, the dust alone is also another thing for us to deal with. We also have armed robbers on the road, so there have been instances where armed robbers have attacked our ambulance before. Construction of the Atebubu Amanteng Kwame Dan Sukejeji Road, classified under the Koko Roads, was halfway done and work has not resumed since 2018. This road is a major road, major road, because we have got Pantu here. The, uh, the northern part, they, apply, they, they come to uh, Ketekarachi and cross the Pantu so that they, 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 they take the journey to uh, Kumasi. That will be very smooth for them. But now they, 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 they are not coming here. They, they, they pass to Yeji because of the nature of the road. The health directorate which regulates health services in the district is eager to expand the facility but also faces similar situation. Committing resources to improved health care at the Senate West District Hospital would be key in achieving the United Nations Sustainable Development Goal 3, which requires the provisions of quality and accessible health care for all by 2030. And that's it for Mission. Mission is supported by the Star Ghana Foundation with thanks to Danida, UK Aid and the AU.